Welcome to Cyberworld YT. This video delves into the fascinating world of hacking. But you know, it's crucial to understand that hacking can be either good or bad, depending on the intent and actions of the hacker. Think of hacking like a lock and key. Just as a key can be used to unlock a door, it can also be used to secure it. You can use a key to break into a house, or you can use it to protect your own. Similarly, hacking skills can be used for malicious purposes or for safeguarding information. Ethical hackers, often known as white hat hackers, are the good guys in this scenario. They use their skills to identify and fix vulnerabilities in websites and computer systems, ensuring that these systems are secure from malicious attacks. Once they find these weaknesses, they report them to the system owners, providing detailed insights on how to fix them. This proactive approach helps in making the internet a safer place for everyone. In this essay, we're going to explore the methods and techniques hackers use to find these weaknesses. We'll dive into the tools they use, the tricks they try, and the strategies they employ to uncover vulnerabilities. Remember, this information is intended for educational purposes. By understanding how hackers operate, you can better protect yourself and your digital assets. Use this knowledge to enhance your own cybersecurity measures, ensuring that your systems are well protected against potential threats. It's important to never use this information to harm others or to break the law. Ethical hacking is about building a safer digital world, not causing chaos or damage. Ethical hackers often work with organizations to conduct security audits, ensuring that their systems are robust and resilient against attacks. They also participate in conferences and workshops, sharing their knowledge and staying updated on the latest cybersecurity trends and threats. Many ethical hackers mentor the next generation of cybersecurity professionals, passing on their skills and knowledge to ensure a safer future. Their contributions are often recognized and celebrated within the cybersecurity community, highlighting the importance of their work. The journey of an ethical hacker is challenging but rewarding, filled with continuous learning and the satisfaction of making a positive impact. By working together with organizations and individuals, ethical hackers help create a more secure and trustworthy digital environment for everyone. So as we dive deeper into this essay, let's appreciate the vital role ethical hackers play in our digital world and learn how we can all contribute to a safer internet. Why do people hack? There are many reasons. Some hackers are curious. They want to see how things work and if they can break them. Others want to steal information. This could be your passwords, credit card numbers, or personal details. They can then use this information to steal money or commit identity theft. Some hackers want to cause trouble. They might delete important files or take over websites. Whatever the reason, it's important to understand how hackers work so you can protect yourself. Have you ever gotten an email that looked like it was from your bank? It might look very convincing with the bank's logo and official sounding language, but don't be fooled. It might ask you to click a link and update your password. The email could even warn you about suspicious activity on your account to create a sense of urgency. Be careful. This could be a phishing attack. Phishing attacks are designed to trick you into revealing sensitive information like your passwords, credit card numbers, or social security number. Phishing is when hackers trick you into giving them your personal information. They can use this information to steal your identity, access your bank accounts, or commit other types of fraud. They might send fake emails, text messages, or even create fake websites that look real. These messages often look like they come from trusted sources such as your bank, a popular online store, or even a friend. Never click on links in emails or messages you don't trust. Always be cautious and double-check the sender's email address. If something feels off, it probably is. If you need to update your information with a company, go directly to their website or app. Type the URL yourself instead of clicking on a link. This ensures you're going to the legitimate site. Don't use a link someone sent you. It's always safer to navigate to the website yourself. Remember, your personal information is valuable. Protect it by being vigilant and cautious online. Websites and apps store information in databases. These databases are like the digital vaults of the internet, holding everything from user credentials to transaction histories. Think of a database like a giant library, meticulously organized and managed. 
Each row of shelves represents a table, and each book on those shelves is a record. Each book is a piece of information, like your username or password, or even more sensitive data like your credit card details or personal messages. SQL injection is a way for hackers to sneak past the librarian and steal the books. This technique allows them to manipulate the database by inserting malicious SQL code. They do this by injecting malicious code into the website search bar or login form. This code tricks the database into revealing or altering its contents. If successful, they can gain access to all the information in the database. This means they can read, modify, or even delete data, causing significant harm. This is why it's important for websites to have strong security measures in place. Implementing robust security protocols, such as input validation and parameterized queries, can help prevent SQL injection attacks. Regularly updating software and conducting security audits are also crucial steps in safeguarding databases. By staying vigilant and proactive, we can protect our digital libraries from unauthorized access. Educating employees about the risks and signs of SQL injection can further enhance security. Awareness and knowledge are powerful tools in the fight against cyber threats. Utilizing multi-factor authentication and encryption can add additional layers of security, making it even harder for hackers to breach the system. By implementing these measures, we can ensure that our digital information remains safe and secure, providing peace of mind for users and businesses alike. Section 5. Brute Force Knocking Down the Door Imagine trying to guess someone's password. You could try every word in the dictionary, right? That's the idea behind a brute force attack. Hackers use computers to try thousands of passwords every second until they find one that works. This is why it's important to use strong, unique passwords for each of your online accounts. Section 6. Meet Kali Linux, the hacker's toolbox. Kali Linux is a special operating system that comes with lots of tools for testing security. Ethical hackers use it to find and fix vulnerabilities. Think of it like a toolbox. Inside are screwdrivers, hammers and wrenches. But instead of fixing houses, these tools fix websites and computer systems. Let's look at some of the tools inside Kali Linux. Section 7. Nmap Mapping Out the Target Before you can fix a leaky faucet, you need to find it. Nmap is like a map for hackers. It helps them see what's running on a computer network. This could be computers, printers, or even security cameras. Nmap helps ethical hackers find weak points that need to be protected. Section 8. Metasploit Ready-Made Exploits Metasploit is a powerful tool that helps hackers find and exploit vulnerabilities. Think of it like a collection of keys. Each key can unlock a specific type of lock or vulnerability. Ethical hackers use Metasploit to test their defenses and make sure their systems are secure. Section 9. Wireshark Listening In Imagine you could listen in on the conversations happening between computers on a network. That's what Wireshark does. It captures data packets as they travel across the network. This allows ethical hackers to analyze the traffic and look for anything suspicious. Section 10. The Importance of Ethical Hacking As we've learned, there are many ways hackers can exploit vulnerabilities. That's why ethical hacking is so important. Ethical hackers use their skills to find and fix these vulnerabilities before the bad guys can exploit them. They play a vital role in keeping our online world safe. Section 11. Learn more with CyberWorld YT. Want to learn more about ethical hacking and cybersecurity? Subscribe to CyberWorld YT on YouTube. We release new videos every week on topics like phishing, malware, and penetration testing. Join our community of learners and help make the internet a safer place.